Hi, my smartphone cut me off again. Okay, I don't have much time. Um, this is the part three of my lesson plan. I'm supposed to have only two parts, but never mind. Okay, um, uh, I'd like to make a correction that I've talked about the blocks. Actually, you have according to this lesson plan, a block is uh, I mean like a group of uh, textbook material, and another block is a group of non-textbook material. Okay, talking about the while lesson, pre-lesson and uh, post-lesson. So actually, uh, what I've been told is the pre-lesson, um, what the core learning standard that you're teaching, for example, learning and listening and speaking. So you can integrate the read, uh, the skill of reading in the pre-lesson, and uh, maybe in the post-lesson, you can use language arts. So you can use the skills that is not the core skill that you're teaching in your pre-lesson and your post-lesson okay so uh, that is the basic 101 of um, for you to understand the lesson plan for you to do the lesson plan is for you to uh, ask your teachers ask your JU or ask your master trainer because uh, I'm just briefing you for you to know because I um, I myself is hasn't gone through on how to write the lesson plan. My advice is for you to sit down together with teachers in your areas and uh, plan together your lesson plan and um, collect it or gather it together. And by next year, you already have your lesson plan including materials. Okay, I forgot to tell you that you can uh, do, using these super minds, you can use uh, more than one skill in one lesson. But when you teach your using your textbook, you need to go by skill. Never mind. Uh, I'm also confused about that. So let's just talk about uh, the textbook material. Okay. So the my smartphone is already blinking. So I'm saying goodbye. If you have any question, if I've said anything wrong or facts are wrong, please correct me. Your JU or Master Strain over there. Okay, so I'll be seeing you next time with another topic. Please follow me. Bye.